How is Wishes Loses Run gun? Has he dropped the game? I actually have not checked. Do you know that? Has not dropped one game since losing that RPS round one. Damn. Well, so we're in for a treat here. I know Scion's one of the better beyond, one of the better Cobalt players, so is it going to be one of the highest level sets we've seen besides, you know, them versus Lily? Yeah, I'm a, I'm really glad this is happening, actually, because there's been a lot of, like, Geno discourse in Cobalt Dev recently, where Shazayan thinks that, um, or Scion thinks Geno is actually kind of bad, and everyone else is like, no, Geno's really good. I just haven't seen it yet. And, uh, I think this match will kind of determine if Geno gets fucked or not, honestly. <laughs> Okay, uh, just reports, reports coming in that, uh, that, uh, Wish is gonna throw for this exact reason, uh. Of course, of course. That, that, that makes perfect sense. Yeah, get some buffs. Come on, free, what are, what, I mean, I guess the title of Burger's And is worth more than a silly little character buff. Burger's and Gino buff? <laughs> The thing is, I think that would actually work too, because after after hype note works like that, if if Brandon V is gonna be like, see, you're just <laughs> such. I'm not sure I have to play, but that'd be that laggy. Like, I don't even care about anything else. I just really like Gino's sound effect. Oh yeah, Gino's sound effects make him feel like he's pulled right out of the game. Yeah, I love it. Oh, uh, I just got back from hosting a PM local at my college. Really? How's that yeah. go? I uh, had, had seven entrants. That's still something to be proud of. I mean, having more than one person who wants to play the game with you is all it really takes, you know? And like, a seven-man round robin can still be pretty competitive and, and fun. Yeah, somebody popped off, you know. There's a pretty, there's a pretty instant, intense Link Knuckles set, you know? <laughs> Did you, were you the Link? Or the Knuckles? I could no, see somebody popped I was, I was Meta Knight, I just won with Meta Knight. But somebody popped off because they were playing Link, cause Link Knuckles, and it was like a 15-minute best of five. They are both pretty new. That's pretty cool. I love seeing newer players get really high for me. Do a little stuff. Wait, what's even happened? This is is which ending? Yeah, okay. Kind of missed it. When did he used to kill there? You see, so strong. There we go. Yeah, Gino, Gino likes to stall with down B and down air a lot, but they're both punishable, if you know. Uh, know the little details, like you can hit the hitboxes with down B. It's pretty okay, because it's like lingering moves, like a fox back air, really good at that. Oh, I like the I like the CC down B from Lin a lot since it's kind of you know it's an activation hitbox that dashes forward a lot. People like try to hit your couch and dash back with something might might get caught by that. That's actually really smart. So what's an activation hitbox for those who don't know, including me? Um, so it's it's a so when you press the move, like a big hitbox might uh, appear in front of you, kind of. But it doesn't actually do any knockback or damage, it just checks if someone is in that range. And then if they are, the move activates and goes there. Okay. Which is sort of how um, Lin Downby just checks like a, a, a line for... Uh, not like... like I'd say like half a Smashville link in front of it. And uh, if they're in there, she'll dash them. And if they're not, she's like stuck in, in lag for like 90 frames. Basically death off stage. And should be death on stage to us anyone that knows her. So is there, is there any other move like that in Smash? Yeah, the, there are some activation hitboxes. I can't think off the top of my head, but they, I, I know there are a few. Oh, Robin, Robin Downby is actually another good example. Um, no, I guess that's a command grab. What am I talking about? Yeah, it seems like a command grab. I'm literally just not thinking. I know there are others. Link Final Smash. Sure. Oh, yeah. That is exactly what Link Final Smash is, actually. Most final smashes. Dev has the knowledge. Mm -hmm. This perfect. Wait. 
we could random switch? Yeah, to, to the best character in the game. Oh my god. I mean, his Black Knight, really good, but like, Lin is kind of his bread and butter. I don't really? Know. I thought he was a, a Shadow Mate. Shadow and Lin, yeah, are definitely his two best. You know, it's it's kind of his game, so he can play everyone pretty pretty well. But Shadow and Lin are kind of his, his children. It makes me so mad that Scion doesn't moonwalk with Shadow or teleport Edge Cancel with Black Knight. Like, come on. At I least, know. At least give us something for the fans. I think I think maybe he's a little nervous in tournament because he's not a moonwalker, which is really sad because Shadow's moonwalk is like the coolest thing ever. Mm -hmm. But I do usually see him go for the, the up the Edge Cancels. I think that's like the biggest way to play Black Knight, honestly. Mm -hmm. Having that, like, Full control teleport the entire time that Shadow and Black Knight have is like, you know, Cobalt's not like a super popular, massive project, so there aren't really people developing the game, back to the game or blah, 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 the characters to that extent. But if there were, I think both of those characters would just get better and better over time because of it. Mm. There's so much you can do. It's kind of a get out of jail free card if you use it right. Right? Like imagine. Um, just add a shield onto an edge cancel on the platform, and then immediate air. Yeah, you could just like muscle over them really hard too. Like I played Black Knight for a while, and I would be stuck in the corner, and then I would just <laughs> be like, call an ambulance, and then I would up the teleport cancel off the edge cancel the platform, and then I would near them, and it'd be like, but not for me, and then I'd kill them off of it. <laughs> That's so good. I, I play so many Black Knights that every time I restock, they like, you run toward them, they'll run to one side of the edge, you move toward them, and they'll teleport through every single time, and they're like, <laughs> I swear they all think they're geniuses for that. <laughs> Me, I will jab every time. Black Knight jab is stupid. Yeah, yeah, it's pretty good. Look at that. That's still wow. also kind of crazy. <laughs> Dang, Wish is, Wish is really good. <laughs> Maybe tough. Yeah, you can tell Wish is like, damn, I like this Geno. I'm gonna play this mod now for like ever. It'd be the best. Yeah, he, uh, he's won co op tournaments before. He's kind of always been the Geno. Nice. I have trouble like just controlling Gina right. He feels really awkward to me, but I love down special so much. It's like one of the most fun moves I've ever used. Very well. Let's Ran on his third character. Glad to, glad to see him with the Shadow to try. I would have liked to see him just like stick it out the whole time with either Lin or Shadow and just do his best, but I, I respect, you know, part of the point of these tournaments is just to test out different characters. Oh? Is this real? 
I've never seen Witch play Shadow. That's funny. There's no time to play games. There's no time to play games. All right, rate rate their shadow skin choices, Trinity. You you have good good opinions on aesthetic. Um. Uh, I like both of these. I think they're both pretty good. The night ones, like, I hate the the night Sonic skins for some reason, but the shadow ones actually look pretty good. Yeah, I like the sh the purple ones. Uh, I I prefer Wish's skin because I can see more of Shadow, while yeah. Cyan looks more like a blob. I think but so. and I yellow and black is just sick. Yellow and black is just awesome. The shoes look really good. Shadow's blast attack is like the most painful thing ever. I I didn't realize how how real Rascal, which is just like charging an aerial down special onto someone and then it launches them right in front of you. Rascal blast attack with Shadow just freezes them in place forever and he can literally just do whatever he wants. Alright, I kind of tuned out the Shadow Ditto for a minute there. Yeah, same. I was like, blah, blah. Happening. Lots of, uh, lots of back airs, lots of dash attacks, classic Shadow. Down tilt? Oh, that was sick. Shadow back air used to just be a multi-hit, but it recently got worked into something like a Mario down air. Oh, really? Hit though. Yeah. <laughs> Shadow Backer is a cool move. Yeah, I really like it. Are all these shadow animations custom? Not all of them, but a lot of them. Uh, do you know who Happy Mela is? Yeah, I know them. Yeah. Yeah, I think I think they work on the island too, but he's a really great animator that's done all, pretty much not I wouldn't say all of, but a lot of the animation you see in Cobalt is done by Happy Mela. Yeah, Sonic Shadow animations are also sick. Yeah, I love them. He's really talented. Black Knight used to literally just have like a Ganon down throw, and then Happy gave him like the most iconic throw. Oh yeah, this like the sword one. Yeah, where he just puts you on the ground and stabs you. Classic. Bonk. Bonk. Somebody moonwalk, please, for the fans. <laughs> for the fans. <laughs> for the fans. I don't know why there's two shadows on screen and neither of them are moonwalk a single time. It's... Side. come on. Like, come on! Wish, uh, wish up a stock. Not a really big percent lead. I think if Scion gets an early kill, it's pretty much even. But Not... this is gonna change what you just said. Yeah. Don't wanna get wrapped up that high. Can't wait. Getting pee peed on now. Oh wow, finally some spin dash action. There we go. Alright. All right. Brandon does some nutty thing in the shadow sometimes. Back for a moment. Never mind. Yeah, there we go. Damn, alright. I am not gonna play Grimms. Good, play... Good luck, Lily. Good luck. Thanks, Camry. 